Very nice win coming out of the maidens. Plum Pudding and uh, Callum Dixon did confirm that Andre Nell did name this filly after Corner Orpha, so which was always a very nice. Plum Pudding, well done. Nice filly, and obviously uh, she's going the right way. Uh, definitely, um, Grant. She, uh, I was super impressed with her today because uh, I, I said last time when I got off her, I think she's going to relish when she goes further. So today she got a bit of a bump coming at the start, but I was happy to give her a chance and she was traveling really comfortably under me and uh, she actually hit the front way too soon. Uh, she, but she came into the shot, I had so much horse under me, she just started picking them off one by one and I just allowed her to run in my hands and then when I asked her the question, she gave me a really nice kick. There was nothing really ever that really threw out a real challenge to you? Not at all, and like I said, I think she, she hit the front a bit too soon because she got there and she picked the ears, but she never gave up, you know, and I was a little bit worried about that when she got there, but she, she was gutsy today. Um, just well done to the whole team. Um, special well done to, to Dixie, you know, when I worked there last week, or it was yesterday, she gave one or two coughs, but he boiled it down to being bedding. So good call on not scratching her. She, she was super well today. Going down to the start, she really was, she was fresh on, under me, and... Uh, I think she's going to be even better when she goes a bit further too. So it's not just the name that's going to be something that brings you close memories with her, but also her ability. So I think there's going to be a nice relationship blooming. Definitely, and I've, I've always liked her from the beginning. You know, I think she, I always said she, she reminded me of that filly Kuva brute of Brett's, but they were completely opposite. She stays another filly was a sprinter, but very similar also at, at home. And uh, just again, well done to, to uh, Andre, to Mrs. Blattner, to Dixon. To Anthony Andrews, who also, like I always always say, does a lot of work behind the scenes for us. Always there in, uh, in the morning to help. And uh, yeah, this one's for the family. Top job. Well done. Thank you. Well done to Corner Offer. Let's find out more from Callum Dixon and Alistair Cohen. Thanks, Grant. Yeah, Plum Pudding is the winner of race number seven on the card. Daughter of Silvano, who's so upwardly mobile. How much improvement has she made in the last couple of months? Yeah, it's just uh, being Val Silvano, you know, they're just going to keep on getting better and better. And the further we, she goes also, she, I think she's just going to keep on propelling from here. Obviously, very, very happy with the win first run out the Maidens. Corne expects her to come into her own even more over further. Do you share those sentiments? Yes, I do think so. You know, um, since the Maiden, when also her work at own progress, she put up very, very good work last week, Friday, and she's been jumping out of her skin this week back home. So, um, yeah, I'm just really relieved. The odds going along very nicely, isn't it? Yeah, no, last week Saturday wasn't the greatest day for us, but you know, you, you take it on the chin, you crack on. So, also, is the two runners for us today so far have run well, so yeah, we keep boxing on. Keep it up, well done, Callum. Thank you so much, Ali. Obviously, really, really good. Well done to Mrs. Platner, she's at the farm. Um, well done to Andre, well done to, to Alfred, um, Anthony, Corner, really good ride, so very happy. Big team, happy team. Always, thanks. Well done, Callum Dixon. Nice to uh, know that Mr. Platten is out of the farm. Well done, and uh, hopefully we'll see you back here soon. It's Plum Pudding who wins race number seven on the car. There was a lot to like about this one. She's definitely going in the right direction.